Hey YouTube people, what's up? Atlas right here. You guys can kind of see me if I'm recording this on Twitch, then you guys can see me. If I'm recording this on PlayStation, then I am sorry. <laughs> but, anyways, A, it's another Friday. This is the second Friday that Azura's came. It's the second second week for Destiny 2. I don't think people were playing Destiny 1 anymore. But anyways, you can find Azur on Titan this time. He ain't on Nessus anymore. You'll see he's right here. Just mark him. Go to the rig. Also remember, I think you gotta be... Either has to be at least 20, or you have to... Or be uh, level 20 and complete the campaign. I can't remember which one it is, or both. I can't remember if you gotta beat the campaign and be level 20, or just be level 20 to Caesar. To Caesar. I think you gotta be... I think it has to be both. But anyways, today, I think he's got a pretty good, I think he's got a pretty good weapon. I already checked out his wares, and the, the weapon that he's selling is actually pretty good. Not like last week's. His first week weapon, oh my god. And I also heard they've already introduced strange coins, but so far I've not seen a single one. But then again, I've been focusing more on my book. So anyways, you go through here. He's actually kind of easy to find. Sorry, my voice sounds a little, a little like crap. Really? Very bad time. So well. Give it a second. Are you the same now that you were before? Guardian, the fallen are bringing in their armory Probably. again. You'd think they'd know better by now. Sorry, but no, I'm actually kind of okay. Alright, Zer, what do you got for us, buddy? May we speak? We may speak. Yes, we may. Alright, this week, he's got the Wardcliffe Coil. I already got that weapon. It is really good. I love it. See, as you can see, I got mine a 282. It is a really good rocket launcher. What it does, do I have any ammo? I do. I'll show you guys afterward when I'm He's done interviewing, nine. whatever it is. Okay. Ward Cliff Coil's got... It deals... Blah, what was it? It has 270 light. It does arc damage. Ingenuity, desperation, a, ha a haphazard prototype of a terrible power... Of terrible power. Such were the fact... Such were the factors at the the at play in the Wardcliff incident. Okay. Blast radius, velocity, and the blast radius and stable or stable blah, 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 sorry. I have been stream I'll throw something out there for you guys on YouTube. I'm sorry, I've not streamed in a while. I have not streamed in a while. My tongue is like really twisted. I've been focusing more on my novel. I apologize for that. So if I get like all tongue tied, I, apolog I apologize. And I also apologize for the rat right behind me. Alrighty. Such were the factors at play in the Wardcliffe incident. Okay, the blast radius and stability is really good. Velocity is out of the rank is amazing. Uh, handling is really good as well. Reload is. Weakest out of them all, but it's still good. Rounds per minute, 60, and one magazine size. Let's go check out it. Let's go check it out. This weapon fires a volley of rockets, and oh my god. As you can see, it's awesome. Okay, you can infuse it, you can attach weapon mods, and you can attach ornaments. <laughs> okay, it's got a vault. As usual, you can't really change anything of it can't really change anything this weapon optimized for a specific a spe blah, specifically explosive payload extend mag you can't change anything of it I'm sorry you can't so that's the disadvantage of having a of being picky and having an exotic weapon you can't really change anything of it you can't change a part next up you got the foe tracer it's a hunter class helmet, uh, 270 li light as you can see, and the description says, I see you. <coughs> Sorry. 
I'm not really honestly feeling that well. So I'm honestly surprised I'm even doing this. Okay. Mobility, resilient, or mobility. Blah, 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 blah. It focuses on mobility and resilience and less on recovery. Relentless tracker. Visual. Actually, let's read in here. Relentless tracker. Uh. Visually marks target or targeted enemies, deals more damage to low health marked enemies. Okay, that's pretty good. So, you can in either increase the resilience or focus more on health. That's pretty much it. And this comes with a energy bracket mod. Improves weapon handling for equipped energy weapon. And excuse me for a moment as I close my window. I'm sorry for the for the inconvenience that is the dog you wouldn't believe me if I said that if I had that weapon up well, that weapon that window open all night and she hadn't made a sound sorry hiccups it comes with an energy bracket mod and increases the it increases its defense by five improves weapon handling for equipped energy weapons and I never did say that thing comes with a weapon attack mod for the arc I'm assuming wait equip Equip this to a kinetic or exotic weapon to increase its attack value. Yeah, it increases its attack value, pretty much it. So that was the foe tracer. Now the next one is ACD slash zero feedback fence. It is a Titan class gauntlet, 270 defense as usual. It's a def blah. it's whatever it is. It's um definition or whatever the thing on the bottom it says the active contact defense system uses war set hole materials to store a re retaliative blah, 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 whatever the fuck that word is retaliatory retaliatory excuse me charge and it's mobility resilience and re it's focusing more on resilience so I'm assuming that in exchange you gotta give up some resilience yeah in exchange for health all right pure conductors melee kills build up explosive energy within the ACD slash O feedback fence being struck by a melee attack unleashes this energy in a devastating devastating explosion I like that I really do like that it's pretty cool Okay, you can either focus, on, focus more on resilience, or you can focus on health. Remember, mobility, obviously, you focus on, like, your speed and jump height. Resilience uh, focuses on how much damage you can take, and recovery focuses on how much health, or how long it takes to recover your health. So that's pretty much the um, ACD slash O feedback fence. Finally, we're going to be moving on to the Sun Bracers. This is a uh, Warlock class gauntlets. 270 defense or light and the description reads when one can wield the fire of stars what use what use in flesh and bones or bone okay it focuses on mobility and recovery but you can sacrifice mobility in exchange for some resilience coat so you can get a balance of all three you can get a balance of mobility, resilience, and recovery. That way you can focus on all three. Okay. And the thing reads, the spot, or helium spirals. Increases the duration of solar grenades and grants grenade energy on solar melee hits. They say so, solar melee hits. Excuse me. As usual, infusion, default shader, and this one comes with a kinetic munition loader. Improves reload speed for equipped kinetic weapons. And did I did I honestly say what this has? Okay, this one comes with an acceleration mod. It increases the defense by five. Increases the armor's mobility, allowing you to move faster. 
So that's pretty much it. That's the only four things that he's selling this week on Destiny 2. I have no clue. I have no clue how long he's going to be here for. Last week, I think he stayed for about five days. So I have no clue how long he's going to be here for. <coughs> Sorry. Anyways, let's go try out this weapon. I've had this weapon for some time and I'm returning loving it. You're returning to the tower? Wait, hold up. I think his name's different. Before his name only had the two dots, now it just has that thing. Zerd, yeah, brothers. Sorry, does. Alright, let's go find some enemies. There should be some close by. That's pretty much it. Does. That's pretty much what it does. Um, let me see if I can find any stronger enemies. Back off. Sorry if I haven't really played in a while. Eh, you'll have to do since you're longer. Okay, here we go. Yeah, it focuses. If you point at an enemy, it focuses on that one enemy or those that are close by. So that's it. Remember, Zer is right over here. I'll run over here really quick. And I'm honestly going to look into how he spells his name now. <laughs> Alrighty. So that's him right here. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch. Link in the description below. Thank you guys so much for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Excuse me for a moment. I like getting headshots. I don't know why. It just like it satisfies me knowing that I got a headshot. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch. Link in the description below. Hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of Zer. Take a bow, Zer. Okay, or fear the light. You're the one. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your visit. Well, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.